Hi guys, it's Lauren of Powerline here. Today we are going to be going over a throwing progression for all these girls to work on. I see a lot of girls come in here with some bad mechanics, not doing some right things. This is going to help you guys' arms be stronger and more accurate during our throw. So there's four steps to the throwing progression which I'm going to run through. The first step is going to focus on us getting our grip and our wrist flick in our throw. So we're going to go ahead and start. Elbow, nice and high, glove under your elbow, nice and in line with your shoulder, keeping your arm up high, wrist up tall, getting our grip, that little C position right there, right across those railroad tracks here, getting our grip, and falling all the way through. Stay nice and strong, working our 12 to 6 spin. Right there, you want arm to fall all the way through your throat, that way you know you're getting enough power. Nice and simple. The next step is going to be feet parallel to your partner. Your shoulders start nice and straight. And then we're gonna be getting, working on our separation and getting our shoulder nice and lined to our target. This is the most important part. We wanna make sure that our shoulder and our glove are always pointing right towards our target. That way we know our throw is going towards the right area. Working on our separation. We're gonna be following through, keeping our elbow high and following all the way through to our opposite shoulder. Another really important thing is that when we're in line with our target, our glove gets tucked. We want to do this to make sure that our throw is strong and accurate. And we're always doing the same side thing with this side. That way this side does the same thing as well. So getting in line with our target. Coming all the way through. Getting our grip. Getting our shoulders in line with our target. Tucking our glove. Coming all the way through. Next, we're going to go ahead, set up straight to our target. Working on getting our separation, staying light, right in line with our target, and our load. This one, we're just focusing on our load, getting that power, leaning back into our leg, and staying in line with our target. So, our target, separation load, coming all the way through to our opposite hip. One more. Load, separation, tucking our glove, coming all, all the way through to our opposite hip. The very last one, we're going to put it all together and we're going to step in line with our target. We want to focus on our foot getting nice and perpendicular to our target. It allows for our hips to open up so we can get in line with our target with our shoulders. On this one, also, when we follow through, we're going to come all the way through with this back leg to make sure we're pushing through and getting all of our power and following through our throat. So, getting our foot perpendicular to our target, and then coming all the way through. But perpendicular to the target, separation, coming all the way through. That's the last part of our throwing drill. We want to stretch our arms out as far as possible. Really go ahead and loop it, take one step back after every throw, get a good stretch in, throw one hop to our partners, and then have them come on in. Thank you.